Hey, it's Ruta Brune here. What are you watching on TV? Now, I've been playing catch up with some series and have a head cold this weekend, so I stayed, stayed home and watched some television in between getting some necessary items done. Uh, first of all, I wanted to tell you about a series with Toni Collette on Netflix called Pieces of Her. The first two episodes are interesting and after that not so much it goes completely downhill and you keep questioning yourself is this gonna get any better should I continue watching or is this gonna suck and I'm not gonna be wasting time that I'll never get back in my entire life and it's true the last thing I said you will be wasting your time Toni Collette is an excellent actress and I love all her stuff but it's the writing and the story that aren't very good but the first two episodes are good. So if you can just cut it off at that point, you could be saving yourself lots of time. And then moving on to another show on Netflix called uh, Bad Vegan. And uh, kind of caught my attention. Apparently that was based on a true story. And you have the actual uh, character of this reality sh documentary speaking in this document documentary series and um, caught my attention the first couple episodes are very you get grabbed in you feel sorry for her but as the series goes on I doubt that she's telling us the truth and I doubt that she's telling us you know the, the true version of events and about her feelings I think she tries to come off as uh, we, she wants us to be sympathetic to her but it's very hard to believe because she's a very intelligent person that started a successful restaurant in New York City and everything goes to hell when she meets up with a con artist whom she says conned her her love feelings and told her her dog was gonna live forever that's just bizarre so I watched it all the way through and um, I wish it was shorter but I I don't really believe her so it was interesting it was a uh, definitely got your attention it's all with uh, money you know fraud greed celebrity it's all in there so if you'd like to watch that it's called bad vegan but if I had known I, I think I wouldn't recommend it Maybe read some articles about it and watch a few episodes. I don't know if you should follow it all the way through, but I don't believe she is telling the truth. That's just the way I feel. And lastly, I have a winner. On Hulu, there's an excellent show. Um, Elizabeth Holmes, The Dropout. It is excellent. It'll grab you and keep you keep you wanting more all the way through. Um, I watched all the available episodes. Um, there's another episode coming on in April, which is soon. So it's called um, The Dropout on Hulu with um, Amanda Siegfried. But it's the story of Elizabeth Holmes. And she was the uh, founder of Theor... Theros, and she was a big fraud, took a whole lot of money from everybody, and she finally got found out that what she was peddling did not work. That I recommend highly. It'll grab you in, and I can't wait to see the next episode. So those are my, my recommendations and my recommendations to skip. So um, <clears throat> I'm not going to stay on too long since I'm not feeling that great. But I just wanted to check in with you guys, and I hope you have an excellent week, and uh, I will talk to you soon.